for me, in terms of the difference between safety one and safety two as views of the world, the first thing is that it is, safety two represents for me a fundamentally different way of seeing the world. So in a safety one world, you're seeing people as hazardous and you're seeing safety, the management of safety, purely about avoiding negatives. In safety two, you're seeing people as crucial for the success of systems and you're seeing safety as the presence of those capacities. So for me, there's a fundamental paradigm shift needed between safety one and safety two. The second aspect is around scope. For me, the scope of safety two includes everything we already look at in what you would call safety one, but it goes broader. So we don't throw out the hazards and the risks and the risk assessments. What we do is we ex expand what we look at, but we apply a different paradigm to the way we look at it. So for instance, when we're, for instance, maybe we're doing a risk assessment around a change to a particular piece of work, rather than just saying, well, what are the hazards? What are the risks? What are the controls, et cetera? We look more broadly and, and try and get a better understanding of how that work actually gets done in reality by talking to the people that do it. And by using that knowledge of what, how the work is normally successful, we then use that to inform our risk assessment as opposed to just looking for hazards and risks. Mm. So, so for me, that represents the sort of the big difference. Um, just to sort of touch on safety differently a little as well. I don't personally use the term safety differently because okay. I don't see that as being as kind of comprehensive a theory as safety too. I see there being a lot of overlaps, a lot of relationships between what they're trying to say, but safety differently to me is more of a unification of a wide range of principles, but safety too is more of a theory grounded in science. And then safety too then leads us on to looking at resilience and the science of resilience engineering. 